Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Nightwing2303 from kicksoncore.com. Um, I went and purchased another pair of SBs, even though I said that I wouldn't. Uh, after I got those um, sea crystals, uh, the mids, but you know, these ones, after I saw them on shelves, they were dope. So um, there is a skate shop uh, in San Jose. That's the only one that I know of, um, and uh, it's at one of the malls there. So this is the Team Red and Filbert. Um, I think that these are really awesome. I know that they came out a while back, but uh, I don't really go out and hunt for you know skate shoes anymore like I used to when I was younger. Um, so you know, but that with that being said, let's go ahead and get right into it. All right, guys. So here is just a quick look. It's a very simple colorway. Um, it's very clean. I just love the maroon on here, or what they call Team Red. I don't really know what Filbert is. So I'm assuming it might be this pattern, um, or the texture, I guess you could say, on the uh, the leather, but um, honestly, I I don't know. It could be this. So well, I used to call these just gum bottoms. I don't know if they have a name for them now, but um, yeah, the last time I skated, man, was back in the day. Uh, I didn't I didn't ever skate in any dunks. Um, this is before they had the Nike SB line, but I used to skate in like the Osiris, um, DVS, Vans, stuff like that. My favorite shoe of all time for skate sneakers was uh, the, uh, what was it, the Osiris D3. Those things were just like gigantic puff clouds of material. Um, those things were awesome. So if you ever have a minute, just go ahead and Google it. Osiris D3. Um, not the 2001 version, it's just the, uh, the original with the two little air pockets back there, or helium pockets. And I thought that those were so sick. Um, I'm still actually looking for another pair. Uh, now, but I can't, I can't find one in my size. So um, that was back in the day when people actually used to use their shoes for skateboarding and all that stuff. Um, use them for what they were meant for, I should say, all sports shoes. So, um, but here you go, back here. I don't know if you could see that, but this is the the leather backing. Um, the materials on these are okay. Uh, the suede is super dope. So I have no complaints with the suede whatsoever. Those are on the uh, underlay panels as well as this little strap here, or I wouldn't say strap, but like a pull tab. Um, the leather that they use along all the overlays and the eye stay, those are, uh, it's a, it's kind of a cheap like split grain, um, but it's a nice color and um, you know, I don't really have any complaints uh, about it. So I don't think that this is nearly thick enough for skateboarding, but you know, whatever. So. <laughs> Like you'd probably thrash these in like maybe about a week or so um, before there's like a hole in there and you need to start using your duct tape. But um, yeah, and then you got this different grain on the swoosh. Still a split, um, but I do like that it has this like red border. I think that, that looks dope. And then let's see, inside, this is like the new insoles. I don't know if you can see that, but it just says Zoom Air. And uh, then you have your basic bottoms. They're not basic anymore. They're, these are like the new bottoms um, for skateboarding. And then this is your injected Phylon hit. So this is Phylon injected throughout the midsole here. Um, it's cased inside of the midsole. And then you have your, uh, or I'll just pull it out, the insole laid on top, which is like one of the most comfortable insoles besides the Reebok Questions. All right, so here's the insole here. This thing was glued in there, so they usually don't do that. Um, it's a big ass piece of glue too. But anyways, so you got this uh, crash pad here at the forefoot, and then you have your zoom air and the heel. And again, there's the the insole. Here's just a quick look at the other one. Same thing. Really nice suede. Love the suede. I like this setup better also. The sea crystal mids that I have, they have the suede on the overlays and then the cheap pebbled leather on the underlays. And this one is reverse, so um, it creases easier and uh, feels better on your foot. So less break in time and all that stuff. Um, heavily padded collars, which is nice. And then they also come with an extra set of white laces. So that's pretty much what it is. Um, I actually love these. These are so dope. So 
Uh, that's pretty much it. Don't expect me to pick up too many SBs. I pick them up if I see them. Um, I actually went in the store looking for something else and I had these on the shelf still so I was like dude I'll just grab these. Um, so but yeah I'll, I'll, I'll pick them up every once in a while if I see any that I like really really like like these guys here. So stay tuned to On Feet. Thank you guys for all your support and um, until next time guys have a good one.